right, look who's back. Did, do, did you have to say, oh, Sparky's back? It's like a dog that's gone missing for a few days. <laughs> oh, Sparky's, Sparky's back. Sparky's back. Yeah, I was excited. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Uh, you know what I love about this time of year is when the when the Christmas records come out. Yeah, and uh, certainly a, a unique one from a, a very talented musician, actually one of Vancouver Island's most acclaimed blues musicians, celebrating the holiday season by by releasing a collection of Christmas songs. David Gogo's new album is titled Christmas with the Blues, and perhaps it's a fitting project for a guy who says that his favorite cinematic Santa is played by Billy Bob Thornton. Well, it's Christmas time, pretty baby. What do you want? Um, Santa? Yeah, I'm Santa. No doubt in my mind, uh, Billy Bob Thornton and what may, may be his greatest role ever is Bad Santa. Or, or actually, I have Badder Santa on uh, Blu-ray, which is the uh, even more outrageous version. So, uh, unfortunately, I can see a lot of myself in that character. Santa Claus Hall's a It's not a song that's going to freak out your grandma. Like if you got the family up for Christmas, you can put it on. Everyone's going to enjoy it. It's not going to, you know, no running to the stereo to turn down. Like Goba's freaking out in the wah wah pedal. If you just took Christmas out of the lyrics, it's just a good blues record. Gogo actually says that the nine original and classic songs on the album are the most traditionally blues sounding tracks that he has ever recorded. The multiple Juno nominee lives on a Christmas tree farm in Nanaimo and says that his customers persuaded him to do this disc. The biggest challenge? Recording it in time for a winter release. It's kind of goofy because it was. It was uh, during the big heat spell this summer. There was no fire in the fireplace because I was afraid I'd burn down the Christmas tree farm if some sparks got out. And you know what? I hate to say it. It's cold tea. It's not even brandy in the snifter. I had to go back and do the session that day, so couldn't get hammered. Oh well. When you see me coming, it'll be in a big black cat. Oh, the time, baby. Some people, it's not a joyous time of the year. You know, it's actually, it's, it's, a, it's a real bummer. Uh, but blues music is is a, a thing that's it's supposed to heal the blues. You're not supposed to just, like, you know, uh, just drown in it. You're, you're supposed to sing it out or, or dance it out or, or whatever you do. So, you know, it, it, it I, to me, it, it, it really fits the season. David Gogo will be performing songs from his Christmas album with a series of concerts beginning this Saturday. He and his band will be stopping in Nanaimo, Vancouver, Duncan, and Victoria. Details available on Gogo's website. Well, while Gogo is providing uh, a soundtrack for the holidays, uh, another local singer-songwriter is raising money for student musicians in Port McNeil. And these are some of my wild heart music kids. And that is Georgia Murray with some of the children hoping to attend Wild Heart Music, a proposed after school program in her hometown. She's trying to hire teachers to facilitate free music classes to make up for arts cuts at Port McNeil schools. I grew up in Port McNeil and I was in choir and I was in band and musical theater and it was a really big part of my life on the North Island. And when I discovered that all of that music had, you know, basically been taken away, I really wanted to do something to bring it back and to help the kids. Well, so far, Murray and her partners have raised more than $20,000 for Wild Heart Music through an online auction. Uh, details on the program and the auction available at georgiamurray.net. Well, Famous People News now, and the Queen of Talk is coming to Vancouver. Oprah Winfrey is staging a, quote, inspirational evening at Rogers Arena on January 24th. Media Mogul is promising to share stories, life lessons, and help people reach their full potential. Last spring, Winfrey appeared in Toronto to shoot a live version of her new TV show, Life Class. Tickets go on sale uh, for the Vancouver show this Saturday through Ticketmaster. They'll cost you between $79 and $369.